okay, it happened. Thought this was gonna happen, but I didn't think it was going to be this bad. Andrew Dabb and Supernatural just confirmed that yesterday's episode, episode 13, is the last episode that's going to air for a while, possibly indefinitely. Definitely not indefinitely. They're gonna finish this show somehow. They've already shot most of it. They just need to edit it together, but I cannot believe we are going to go through another hiatus. Now this one, completely makes sense though it is definitely in the best interest of the crew the cast everyone associated with the show everyone in the film industry in vancouver right now all of their jobs are on hold 125,000 jobs plus went up like smoke last last monday but it is for a good reason it's for safety however it's just unfortunate because this follows the th what the third break since the mid-season break there was obviously the mid-season break which happens over the holiday months but then it returned for like two episodes and then it went away again for like a couple of weeks then an episode and then it went away for a month and a half and we just got our first episode two weeks ago how the fuck are they compiling this so badly was their plan to basically have it consistent from april to march because what four four weeks each so eight weeks seven episodes maybe because usually supernatural ends mainly the middle of may so really from the end of march to the middle of may that was their original plan they could have done this so much better the pacing of this has been so slow and i don't remember it being like this with supernatural season 13 obviously it made sense because there was the writer strike but they at least kind of gave the fans an idea of hey we're going away but we'll be back here. I don't remember having the sense of where the hell did Supernatural go like I did with season three. And season three had 16 episodes, whereas season 15 has 20. Either way, this show has just been put together so, so fucking poorly by Dab. However, considering all this, he might have a chance to save face, but two different results. The first could be he actually could possibly realize just how much of a shit heap he has turn the show into he could finally maybe realize something sit down take this time and be like okay guys we're going to try and not pull a star wars rise of skywalker bullshit cacophony we're going to try and keep to what we've done not retcon bullshit not completely change the lore of the show just for the sake of a joke or some fucking MacGuffin bullshit we're actually going to keep the lore as it is and finish the story properly are the rejection of the whole fucking fan base hating me for being complete and utter twat will be so small and insignificant by that point i'm not going to feel it as badly these two options are definitely what andrew dab is considering because i don't i honestly don't know how the show is going to end well it has been mediocre this whole season the only episode that's been decent i would say was the one they brought eileen back because while that was fan service at least had some decent writing and some decent character development for her and the relationship between her and Sam. Everything else in this season has been mediocre. For a final season of this show, it's been pretty lackluster, guys. I do not have much confidence in this ending with anything but a whimper, and the whimper is a stretch. Anyways, you guys give me your thoughts on this whole hiatus thing. What do you guys think about this? What do you think that Dab might do with this extra time? Give me your thoughts and whatnot in the comments below. If you like the video, leave a like, and if you're interested in more, subscribe. Otherwise, catch you guys next time. Thanks for watching the video. My name is Nitz, and you might remember me from the animated cult classic TV show, Undergrads. It's been a while, but I'm happy to say the click is finally getting back together in an all new movie, thanks to a successful Kickstarter campaign. But we are still asking for your support. To see any and all updates about the upcoming Undergrads movie, be sure to check out and like the Bring Back Undergrads Facebook page. And with any luck, we'll see you guys soon.